worry about it. Yeah, it is multi one. Uh, no, it's just multi. I'm sorry. Ah, last boo. Last time we were trying to, uh, you know, finish up this before I realized, oh wait, I'm going to learn my own time limit. So, that was a thing that happened, so then I'm like, I guess I gotta pause, and then I gotta come back and do it again. And also, I didn't mention this, but I also got new batteries for my camera that I'm also using to record this. Not any super cool editing stuff, like most YouTubers, because, dude, like, slink pod, like, work. Cursor today, man. My own stupidity will be the death of me. Ah, oh. you know what's sad? I was actually like right near the end of this too, so it didn't even matter. Jump down here to get an easy one up. Uh, because if you're not familiar with the stage and who the Boulder guy is, well, you're gonna be in for a surprising. So you might need some one ups. Uh, like, see, after that section, I'd be flying over here, right where the, where the star is located. And I'm actually gonna buy me a... Actually, no, I'm not gonna buy me anything. I don't need six lives or another life. Gosh, I make the most of what I got. Don't need to buy a whole lot. What is this? Incarnation. Da, 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 da. Welcome to the boss fight of Boulder Guys. As the name implies, he is a Boulder made guy. And like I said, with the bomb boos or the, 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 blast, the blast boos, you can break stuff with them like stone. So his main attack, his main way of attacking is throwing bomb boos at you like this. Just regular rocks and coin rocks, which also restore your health if that was if coins weren't already a thing that you already knew. Um, and his now he's in the second phase where he can actually physically punch you with his fist. And the only thing that changes is that he can hit, hit with a fist. That's really all that changes in this fight. Also, there you have. You don't have to take away the fist to hit him. You can. You just. You just gotta move around him to hit him. The only other attack that I didn't just explain was that he can make rocks come up from the ground and try to hit you. It is easier to hit him though if you get at least one arm out of the way. Out of the way. Would you get out of the way? And that's his summoning rocks. It's pretty much pillars of rocks. He can also punch through them for you. As shown there. <laughs> so, this boss isn't really hard per se, as long as you know what you're doing. And as soon as I say that, I get it. Typical, typical of yours. Darn it, Marty. You just keep proving us wrong and wrong again. In a, in a sense, this is one of the one of the Mario bosses that takes actually eight hits to actually destroy completely. Because if he because he takes three hits to get to this form, and then it takes one hit to hit his uvula or whatever that is to destroy him. But anyhow, after we do that, then we get the star. See, it didn't. This didn't even take me another try. Only the platforming part. Only the platforming. And look at how many star bits I get to keep now. This will be useful later. But for now, we got a star! Star collected. And I'll save the game. I wish we could have ended off like right back here so I didn't have to do Jack, but now as you can see there is the question mark star, which I will get later after we do Beach Ball Galaxy. And start doing GUI based stuff. I know the next 
two levels relatively, I know them relatively well, and I will not probably fail on them super bad, but we'll have to wait and see. The Secret Undersea Cavern. Urn, urn, urn. You have to put more urns into your calves, I think. Also, there's a secret in this world that I also know where it is, but we are not we are not getting that until later as well. So for this mission, mission start. Uh, I mean, for this level, you want to get a shell, preferably a green one, and go. Hey, guy, break it. And then he's like, Whoa, man. How could you, how did you break it, man? That shell is smaller than the rock wall. And by the way, that is not there in any other level. Also ominous, no music. Seriously, ominous, no music. Ow! Bats! I'll, I'll give you five right across the face. Anyways, and then after that, then all we have left is platforming. There's a free one up if you go this way. There's also deaf if you go this way. Introducing box swamps, I believe they're called. I don't know the official names of these guys, I'm sorry. And if you fall like that, you automatically die. You know, well, there's actually double black holes in this level. One that can, makes the water and one that drains the water. Okay. Uh, no, you can also not do that either. And I also did go the wrong way, so... Good thing. And just to show that you could die again, I guess I did that too. <laughs> Uh, I guess keep proving myself wrong and wrong again. Uh, then it turns back around. No! Ah! Oh, shucks, man. Okay, no more dying. Time to get serious. This is for real, man. I meant the exact opposite. Ah, uh, like sigh. If I die again, I will be very disappointed in myself. There is no need for me to die. Again. Come back this way. Jump over here and not die. Then we're gonna have to fry these platforms. Aw, oh, man. If I didn't have that spin jump, I would have been dead. Uh, so then jump, long jump over here, and walk up this little path. Yeah, this is the right way. Walk up over here. Be careful of this block again. Uh, we'll die because of stupidity of reason. Then he turns back around. As long as you're under where his teeth are, you will not die. I swear, I tell, I tell you the truth on that one. See, it conducts water and then it takes it away. And also these one, actual swamps will kill you on one squash, because squash damage, you know. But anyways, with that, we can now collect, <sighs> collect a star. We got the star! Also do notice, I also did notice that on the gamepad it's a lot, it's a lot more H D res than it is here, but that's our 30 second star. Wait for the picking. Another story has been added to, yeah. We'll get, we'll, we'll, I'll read those later. And you guys can actually hear my awful reading voice. Um, we're not gonna do that, because Commodore will be late, a little bit later, once we get to the halfway point of this game. 
But first, let's go to Bowie Base Galaxy. Drop the base. Jump, jump. 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 Now this one is interesting because there's actually two stars, which I will both be getting in this episode because they're relatively easy to get. The Floating Fortress. You gotta get all the way up there for the first star. So, but like it showed, we have to go down below. Why? Because the thing is not floating yet. Also, I love this music. I don't got a shell, but there are... Uh, oh, by the way, the swimming mechanics in this section is, are pretty bad. Once you hit a bullet bill into that... Oh no! Not the light for servers! And then it rises up to the base galaxy. So now we can go up there. And also, magical honeycombs, man. There are also bloopers in here which don't seem to harm you unless you get really close to them. So, as long as you stay out of their way, they won't get in your way. Uh. Today I'm recording 10 and, 10 and 11th on October, I believe, the 5th. Or is it today the 4th? Uh, nope, it's the 5th. Uh, when I uploaded uh, part 8 and 9. Let me tell you something, my computer can be really be a jerk when it wants to be, like, it doesn't even have to physically try. Now, I know a shortcut to the stage where if you backflip off of the... Ow. If you jump like this, and you spin, and then you do that, and you land over here, where you need to actually be without having to do a lot of power. That activates that, which I don't think you... Do I need? I think I could have just back flipped off the screw, that's what I'm thinking. Dang, dang. Dang, that gets us this. Uh, I see blue chips there, but I don't see much of a reason for them right yet. Alright. Spin. To make these platforms move. I know why we need the blue chips, so I'm gonna have to go back and get the one. Here we go, and we go up here. Watch out for the wall. The, 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 the watts? I forget what these enemies are called. But they will electrocute you, and it will hurt. Hey! See? You're gonna give me that blue chip. Oh man, look at platforming on the stage as you can currently see. Don't crush me. Got it. Okay, now that I'm done with my musical number, can I get up here and flip and flip and stomp? Yeah. Damn. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Also, uh, I'm making so much progress. Ouch. Well, not really ouch. Well, if you were getting slid, slid around while your finger was getting jammed, I think you would be I can't crush you. The boing. I didn't do what I wanted to Okay, now I'm going to climb up the tower fairly quick because we're wasting more time on this level than any of the others right now. Except the one I died on twice, but I have a perfect explanation for that. Because pirouettes! The point at the screen, pull yourself over here. Watch out for this thing that shoots random lasers. There's another one, but this one you can screw down. Na 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 na! And there's, and there's our star. We got the star! 
Sorry for the bad Mario impression, by the way. Uh, actually, I'm not sorry, because you can't stop me. No copyright law in the universe can stop me. Yeah, and then with a third, a third, thirty, thirty, thirty third star. Gosh. Well, like my thirty third anniversary of being dumb. Uh, <laughs> uh, gamepad screen. Back to regular. Now let's go back to boo wee base, boo wee base, go boo wee base, all in your face. And this is actually a secret star. That's a green star. So let us go ahead and go back to this one, the floating fortress. And go get it. Now this one is actually not that hard to find. The star is not actually hard to find. It's actually more concealed though than most of the other stars. In the fact that it's not somewhere where you would actually expect to look. Or if you are exploring, you would find it on accident. First of all, we need a thing called a I can't see. Camera, 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 please. If there's anything I do hate about underwater sections in this place is that the camera can sometimes just be... You didn't hit the glass! I gotta go up for air for a minute. I did notice that this gives it more of an 8-bit organ feel when you're under the water. And with this whirlpool pipe, we are now outside of the... outside underneath the buoy base. Yeah, let's try saying that five times fast. Buoy base, buoy base, I'm gonna get this in the face. After hitting that, you get the star. So yeah, it's not super hard, but if you do not know how to lead the ah, the bullet's really hard. I mean, wow. If you don't know how to lead people, it's probably pretty hard. Do we get a cut? Yeah, we get a cutscene. Okay. Yeah. Probably call it off for this video in a minute. But we'll see. You have rescued one of the gr green power stars. Their st those stars have special powers. The green loom is about all about them. If maybe we'll collect all green, all the green stars one day. Anyways, let's go ahead and talk to this guy, and then we're probably gonna end it off because I also did not foretold this event. Thank you for helping me. I am a guardian of the trial galaxies. To restore the door the launch star doorway, we need to get two others like me. Which is hinting that there are two other people who Hey Luigi's not here. Huh hmm. Hold on a minute, you guys. I wanna see what level this guy is Luigi's in. Cause I also didn't check mail, so uh, well, I guess I know what we're doing next time. <laughs> I guess I'm saving my brother. What else? Oh, okay. Well, that uh, thanks. I, I was going to end off the episode, so... Yeah, you can give it to the bridge. But anyhow, guys. Next time on Let's Play Mario Galaxy, we will go and save Luigi. And just for a reference, here we go. Can you guys guess where this place is? Can you? 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 I'm sorry for saying my country's name so many times. But anyways, I'll see you guys then when we go to rescue Luigi.